Right, I'm back in my usual place. So I've got quite a sturdy table now and I've got all my stuff uh, spread out. <laughs> so um, I'm on to my next spread. And I was just sort of skimming through the text because this is what I do. I sort of see if there's anything that comes out to me. And what I noticed... Well, it's actually what it's talking about. It's talking about an old well that they find. And, um, well, let's get it closer so you can see. And there's the well with the Chinese roof. I thought, that's interesting. Um, it talks about the well a bit more. Um, and it's it's got a special old cup. It's the very same cup said the story girl. Basically there's been a cup there for years, a ch little blue china cup. Um, and to me I started thinking about wells and of course I thought about wishing wells, you know, and then I thought about wellness and then I thought about filling the well. And so at the moment I've got these ideas around and I think I'm going to draw a well and I'm going to think about leaving certain words still visible um, and so I'm going to draw a well and I'm going to think about what I put into it because <coughs> quite clearly for me doing this art is really helping me it, that is what fills my well it um, is something that um, replenishes my energies in some way. And I think it's something we all need to be doing at the moment. Um, because if we do that, then when we need to give to, to somebody else, when we see somebody else struggling, we're full and we can give. And um, so we have to spend time filling up that well. Anyway, so oh, of course it's gone off now. So I'm just picking up my phone here to show I've got I've, I've been looking around online and that to me is like a pagoda roof and that to me is like a well. So I'm going to use these as um reference for drawing my well and um start there. So I'll be back when I've when I'm sort of done that and we'll see what happens next. sketch. So I've got a, a kind of a big um, vase flowing into the well. Um, now I know I said I wasn't going to gesso it but for the purposes of this page I think I do need to gesso. So the handy old gesso is going to come out and I'm going to do a bit of gessoing. What I might do is use clear gesso on here so that um, it's just easier to paint over and this talks about um, a leafy vine and I didn't fancy 
drawing it on there. So what I might do is I might put some leafy vines around the page and then I'm going to have this white so that I can write my own thoughts on there. So that's the plan. So I've drawn the outline in and I've just this page um, with a jug with the water going into the well and this is the cup where I can drink from the well. So I'm going to paint this now with acrylics when I've got some red. Um, hold on, <laughs> I'll tell you what type of red it is. It's cadmium red hue and the blue is deep turquoise. And then I've got titanium buff, is that sort of buff colour. And I've also got um, raw umber, which is this brown. And then I've got white gesso for the white. I'm going to be using different combinations of those colours to colour in my picture. I got interrupted. It's very chaotic here and um, yeah so I <clears throat> I didn't show you all what I was doing but basically I was just colouring in the drawing um, with the the paints, acrylic paints. I got myself a cup of tea which is quite appropriate um, because this spread is about filling up, topping up your well, your well of bliss you're well of feeling good and it'll be different for everyone but this is my uh, vase, my container that's pouring into my well symbolic and these are the things that I find that really help me art obviously <laughs> hence all this art that I'm doing I do meditation, walks because in New Zealand we are allowed to go for a walk but we have to keep our distance from everybody. We have to have keep two metres distance from strangers. Um, music, chats, and I do mantra. And I do crafts like knitting. So these are the things I know will help me. And it's just to remind myself that during these times we get depleted. We want to help other people too, which is natural and it's good. And But we need to keep that topped up so that we can then have more to give. So <clears throat> using the words that came up, I pour from my bliss into my well. I have a very deep well and when it is full I can give from my overflow. And then to, to sort of symbolise that I've drawn a nice cup of tea which, yeah, there you have it. So that was this spread for today. Um, yeah, I love the way that I find things and from the text and then it prompts me to think about things in a different way. So um, this is my Chinese pagoda style well. And yeah, that's it for today. I hope you're doing good and remembering to top up your well. Art. Do lots of it. Watch my videos, of course. And, <laughs> and I hope to see you again soon. Okay.
Be well. Be safe.